Hey folks, today, let's dive into the captivating story of The Crow, a film that's become an enduring cult classic and a testament to the power of art in the face of tragedy. The Crow, released in 1994 and directed by Alex Proyas, tells the haunting tale of Eric Draven, a musician murdered along with his fiancée, who is resurrected by a mystical crow to avenge their deaths. Starring Brandon Lee in the role of Eric, the film is not just visually striking but also deeply emotional. Tragically, Brandon Lee's life was cut short due to an accident on set, casting a somber shadow over the film. Despite this heartbreaking event, The Crow was both a critical and commercial success. It was praised for its unique gothic visual style, a haunting soundtrack, and Lee's unforgettable performance. The film's themes of love, loss, and revenge resonated deeply with audiences, making it a timeless classic. But how did The Crow come to life on the big screen? The film's journey began with James O'Barr's comic book series, born from his personal grief over losing his fiancée. O'Barr poured his pain into the dark, gritty tale of Eric Draven, capturing the raw emotions of loss and retribution. Hollywood soon took notice and the rights were optioned for a film adaptation. The creative team, including writer John Shirley and producer Jeff Most, worked closely with O'Barr to stay true to the source material. Alex Proyas, known for his visually stunning films, was drawn to the project's dark themes and gothic atmosphere. Brandon Lee's casting was a pivotal moment. A talented martial artist and actor, Lee connected deeply with Eric Draven's emotional journey, dedicating himself to the role completely. His commitment and passion shone through in his performance, making his untimely death even more tragic. The Crow's impact extended far beyond its initial release. Its unique blend of gothic imagery, superhero elements, and rock and roll vibes struck a chord with a generation. This led to a series of sequels and a television series, although none captured the original's magic. In 2024, a reboot starring Bill Skarsgård aimed to reimagine the story for a new generation. Directed by Rupert Sanders, the film received mixed reviews, with some praising its visual style while others criticized its lack of originality. Despite the challenges, The Crow's legacy continues to inspire. Its story of love, loss, and vengeance remains a powerful narrative that resonates with fans old and new. Brandon Lee's final performance is forever etched in our memories, reminding us of the fragility of life and the enduring impact of art. And there you have it, folks. The legacy of The Crow, a cinematic triumph born from tragedy, continuing to captivate and inspire. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more deep dives into your favorite cult classics. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep the spirit of the crow alive.